Hey, what's happening? Rise here on Nelio Gaming. In this video, we're going to be checking out Beautiful Desolation on PlayStation 5. We're jumping right in. All right, so we got a new game. Game settings, video settings, audio settings, language, trophies, credits, extras, and load game. No save games yet, so let's go with a new game. Hey, there's always a first time. Bronze PlayStation trophy right off the bat. Liking that. The Brotherhood Presents. A Bischoff Brothers production. So this is probably a good time to mention that I was provided with a game key thanks to the awesome team over at Evolve PR. So shout out to everyone over there on behalf of the developer and publisher. Beautiful Desolation. Cape Town, South Africa, 1976. Yeah, Beetle. It's got a rear taillight. Padiddle. Charlie, this is the last time. I'm not doing this again. I know, baby, I know. But Don's sick. He needs help. Yeah, but I've tried. I've tried so many times. He isn't interested in help. He's your brother, Mark. He's been through so much. Once he's sobered up, we can all talk. All right, it's always, let's talk tomorrow. No, we'll drop him off at shelter. I know you're right. Go with all, let's see, I know you're right. I know, you're right. It's just late and I'm tired. He needs to know that we're here for him. He needs our compassion and support. He'll be safer with us. He can stay with us for a while. He needs professional help. I'm not looking after a grown man. He does need... He probably needs... I don't know what's wrong with him, but he probably needs professional help. The guy needs professional help. We can get him that help. I know it will be hard, but we can do this. I'm just glad he isn't out in this weather. I haven't seen a storm like this in ages. Jeez, this rain is bucketing down now. Turn on the radio, please turn on the radio. Turn on the radio. Swap now calling the storm of the decade. Reports are in of a complete grid shutdown in the city of Cape Town. Road closures are in effect all across the Atlantic seaboard. Stay tuned for a more detailed report of the top of the Do you hear something? Like, like a low rumble. What is that? Mark? There's something in the sky. What the fuck? Oh, Jesus. Tornado, hurricane. Oh, Jesus. That's a spaceship. Ten years later. Look at Aerodome. Oh, it Aerodrome. Okay. L2, R2, L1, R1. Rustling Scottle. Backy. Okay. So we got movement. 
take item with X. Old energy cell. Okay. Inventory added old energy cell. What do we got here? This item can be combined. Drag over other objects in the inventory. What is that? Backy. What is it? Is that the vehicle? Pressing the touchpad shows hides surrounding descriptions. Okay, a Ford pickup. Yeah, that's the, the truck. A Ford pickup with a lot of mileage on the clock. Looks like it needs a wash. Uh, Bray grill is black with old grease. The new wonder of the world. A modern mystery. The Penrose experience will change you forever. Who writes this? She. Looks like he'll be cra Looks like he's crashing here between flights. Just a mattress, a lamp, some empty bottles. Not exactly five-star stuff. Uh, the glowing sign advertises Kalantor. So this is what Don's been doing with himself the past few years. At Don least has data boxes here. Oh, hello, Don Leslie. Don has high scores on most of these, but I could get, but I could still kick his ass at Pong. Cheap cracked red leather, leatherette with a waft of stale cigarette smoke. And then the last one at the bottom. The only way to reach the Penrose is by air. Tourists will pay big bucks to get there by chopper. Okay. All right. Locked terminal. To use an item from your inventory with your surroundings, move toward any interactable object person until the, hi the highlight appears. Open the inventory and press use with. Okay. Okay. Bedroom. I hope this thing can fly. <laughs> Take Don item. would just leave his stuff lying around. Don's access card, okay. Don's key card. Okay, the mechanic tools. This is blocked off. Old dented car. Is that my old car? Is am, am I the the man that was in that car crash? Don loves his arcade games. Connect to TV. TV Guide, a brief history of the Penrose, episode one. A beautiful docudrama outlining this momentous discovery. Watch now. Later this week. Mutated Inja, age restricted. Back at music with Aegis Stabjans. Uma Ski Skeddy, all ages, living with the Mara Checks. Family drama. Watch now. We're winging it. I don't really know much about the game yet. Kind of figuring that out together. Penrose allied. Ten years ago, our country was at war. At war with who? In the midst of our tribulation, like a gift from heaven, the Penrose appeared. Oh, that's that thing that was in the sky. An object of untold technological abundance that advanced civilization on all frontiers. Like a giant eyeball. Hunger. And disease eradicated, energy mastered, and mortality conquered. But there are those who would oppose the might of Penrose ally, dissenters who fear our progress and our power. Oh, jeez! Our world cast back down into turmoil and chaos. There is no place in the world for these heretics, and they will be crushed beneath the heel of the agnate boot as we march towards our great future. Interesting. Is 
So that ship showed up and gave lots of technological advances. Okay. Arcade machines. I guess I can't play them yet or at all. I guess. Let's see. No, let's back out there. All right. What's next? Um, oh, this bot is fixing. I can't interact with it. Can't go out there. Locked terminal. Key card. Don's key card. Use with triangle. Read messages. Page all pilots. Read messages. Calentor's pilot appointments. Logged in as D. Leslie. Date 13th of March, 86. Upcoming bookings, none. Weather, extreme turbulence expected. Page all pilots. Keep tourists away from the Penrose for the next 48 hours. If you get one more ticket, they consider you consider your ass fired. Don't test me on this, Leslie. Done. Airport wide request was made. Okay. Oh, we're getting. There we go. There's Leslie, D. Leslie, whatever. Talked. Oh, Don. Yeah. Marky, been a while. Can I, I? I wish you had called to let me know you were coming. I would have cleaned up a bit. I know. I hate that nickname. You've grown. I've been meaning to stop by. I've been I heard you worked here. I'll be meaning to stop by. I just, you know, haven't. Yeah, yeah, I've been here a while. About two years, give or take. Nice place to keep out of the cold. You look, uh, healthy. But a bit fit, yeah. But as long as I still fit in the chopper, it's all good. It's been, what, nine, ten years? Last time I saw you was... The funeral. Yes, yeah. Oh, his wife's. Right. So you're out of the chair at least. That's good. Leg brace. Helps with the pain. It is like crazy though. It looks good on you, eh? <laughs> Makes you look like a superhero. I need your help. Maybe this was... I need your help. I need your help, Tom. You're in some sort of trouble. No, no. Nothing like that. I have to get up to the Penrose. You're kidding, right? Not kidding, no. I need to get up there. And you're the only one I know I can do it. Why the hell do you need to get up to that thing? You owe me, just tell me if you can take me there. That's that thing isn't what they say it is. Just tell I me. I just need to know if you can take me up there or not. I can't. I mean, what the hell are you gonna do up there anyway? That thing is huge. Where would we even go in it? There's something that it's growing around. It's human tech. It's man made. I've got the coordinates, I've got the photos. I've even got a military agnet eye for the scanners up there. I just need someone who knows the air. Someone has been close to it. I run tours, little brother. We get too close, and we get shot down. That's the brother they were going after. Okay, fine, forget it. You're the only one who can help me. I know you can get us close. You're a military pilot. You can get us close. You can get us onto it. Ah, oh, shit, man. Okay, fine. If we do this, it has to be tonight. There's a storm warning. They evacuated the whole thing. There won't be any chopper patrols in this weather. Flying in a storm like that is suicide. Once we get up there, we'll only have a few minutes before someone figures it out. I only need to get a backup of the data. Once we get back, we can blow this whole thing wide open. Just tell me one thing. Why the Pendros? Why that thing? I want to know who brought it here. I need to know what it is. You know why. You know why. You know exactly why, Don. We were on the road to pick you up when it arrived. I can't get it back. But I can figure out why it happened. Okay, I like where the story's going. Restricted airspace, Cape Town, 1986. Little hooligan. Going dark. I can't see anything in this rain. Where is it? Don't worry, little brother. He's out there. 
There she is. That thing is huge. How is it floating? It's obviously alien tech or something. Oh yeah, it's definitely alien tech. Look at it. Is he coming with me or staying? Oh, he's staying with me. Okay. Plastic tarps. Bright yellow ground sheets are slick with rain. This, this is amazing. A military blockade has been established below the Penrose. Looks like someone left these in a hurry. Can I get over there? Nope, it won't even let me near it. Okay. I like these top-down games. They're different, you know? Kind of changes things up a little bit. You play, you know, a certain type of game a lot. It's nice to change it up and, you know, check something else out. Totally different than what you're used to. Far below, the waves thrash against dark rocks. So weird. The pitted grounds looks like a calcified coral reef or the inside of an old bone. What is this thing made of? Bone? Okay, here we go. There's two of them. Connect the terminal. Oh boy. Um, I don't know what to... Locked terminal. To combine two items. Okay, we know that. We need a card though. Bone-like formations. Catwalk. Something right there. All this time, they said it wasn't man made. Well, it's probably not man made. Hard to tell if these dark growths are emerging from the probe or boring into it. What are these? Oh, I got an arrow down here. These protuberances lend a disturbing alien feel to the landscape. Don, I told you. I knew they were lying to us. How do we get down there? Far below the waves, okay. No connections found. No maps. Is there any other way down there? No, oh, how am I supposed to get down there? Okay, the green arrow is pointing. There it is, the probe. I knew it. Yeah, but I don't have. Oh, this is the retina he was talking about. It looks just like what's in my. Okay, use. No. 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 What do you mean? Uh uh. Use with. Okay, you can pull out uh, the camera angle with L1 and R1 to zoom in. L2 pulls up. This item can be combined. Drag over other object in inventory, okay? Combine with this. Are you kidding me? Okay. There we go. 
now we can use it all right credentials confirmed okay service officer Piotr Piotr Peter Piotr okay Brackpan division security protocols have been dis disabled for maintenance okay very good Now what? Security protocols, ocean. Growths. I don't know where else to go now. Falsified. have a I don't have the code that's a problem Let's see is there a new path that opened up yet nope still no new path okay so what could what could the code be I guess we could guess. One, two, three, four. Nope. One, 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 one. Nope. Nine, nine, nine. I don't know. Shoot. What could it be? Um, what is the added energy cell, added power, retina, combined, moved on exit? Oh, come on. I need to copy the Penrose data. Yeah, I got nothing. I have nothing for any sort of... I have nothing. This isn't good. How am I supposed to figure it out? 86? Is it a year? Nineteen eighty-six. One. Nine. Eight. Six. Nope. We are in trouble. I don't know what to do. It's a long way down. Come on. Yeah, it just doesn't tell me enough. Shoot. Thing. Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. What is this? Okay, I pressed up on the D-pad. Charlize, Charlize, investigation, there we go. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, 1192, let's try it. So, I pressed 
up on the D-pad. I was just pressing random buttons, and that popped up. 1192 is going to be the first one we're going to try. Okay, that's wrong. Uh, 8738. wrong what's the next one uh, 7734 there we go connected okay welcome director Walter Corman record file system restricted access compl compiled Thursday December 19th 1985 okay manage backup procedure okay prepare data get what you need and get out of here. prepare drive prepare disk return prepare data Okay, prepare to drive, prepare a disk, run back up now. It's here. Well, let's go. Data disk is available at backup terminal. And kind of run with L3. Penrose data disk. Oh. Okay. Halt. Do not move. Get onto the ground with your hands behind your head. We're just here for information. Make us don't shoot. We're unarmed. Hey, don't shoot. It's just two of us. We're unarmed. Do you hear something? Oh, I didn't mean to press that. I didn't see what it said. We'll see what's going to happen here, I guess. Oh, they call it for backup. Oh, wow. Whoa, whoa. What the heck? We just died? We just got turned to dust. I'm so confused. What just happened? I need to... It's the autonomous four-legged support drone is idling. The little drones work away on the probe like bees tending to a malevolent hive. Soft, otherworldly light reflects off the surface of the probe. What the heck is going on? I'm so confused. What the hell happened? Towering... the heck just happened Let's see here let's make a game save Control, come in. Over. okay we, we got that going okay system saved now let's look at this let's look at Alt, don't move. Get, okay, it said control, control, come in. We have two trespassers at Dara's site. Over. over. Do you hear something? And then that happened. Okay. So something strange happened. Right in the middle of it trying to detain us. Now towering temple. A towering temple now stands in the middle of the ocean. The device whirs away, reading data from its strange surroundings. Some sort of scanners. Okay. The growths are made up of an uh, intricate latticework, delicate but strong. This thing, it did something to us. Control, come in, over. I want to go home, Mark. I want to go home. <laughs> I want to go home. I want to go home. Come in. Over. The bony stallions twist upward into the sills. Okay. Hey, 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 what is this? Military troop transport is parked where the Callan Chopper once stood. 
What is this? This is the backup? I don't remember picking this up. It looks ancient. Don, you okay? Holy shit, Mark. Look at this thing. Where the hell are we? We must have blacked out. I know as much as you do. We're still on the Penrose. Well, shit, Don. I know as much as you do. We're all the labs. And where the hell is the topper? I'm going to lose my job over this. Mr. Callan is going to have my ass in a sling when he finds out. We need to get off the Penrose. I don't give it. We've got bigger problems. Look around us, Don. I don't think your job is our biggest problem right now. Yeah, you're right. Okay, so what do we do? Radio someone for help? I'd rather keep our presence here under wraps for now. We need to get off the Penrose. Can you fly this thing? Yeah, it looks like a simple troop transport. Can't be too different from a Chinook. I'll know more once I'm inside. But yeah, if it flies, I can fly it. Where are you going then? We have to get off this thing. See is placid and still. What is this? It's the damn military. It must be them. Damn it. Over. It's locked. No. <laughs> Okay. Range formations. Oh, here we go. Scan complete. Review report. Uh oh. Uh oh. Unclean beings. The only son of Darius. I've been desecrated. <laughs> Holy. We Where sound we? like Australians or... These to this earth. Maybe not. While defiling the sanctorium of Dallas. Accessing additional justice protocols. Please forgive us. We didn't violate... <laughs> we meant no harm. Please, we did not mean any disrespect. Justice protocols loaded. Purging erroneous data. Willfully or unwitting. This thing of flesh has slathered its grime all over the most holy sanctuary. Its pleas for forgiveness are noted in the log for transcription to the record. Connecting to the record, new information has been added to the queue. Yet still, we are required to purge its unclean presence from this place. Initiating DNA scan. Please hold still. Tell us what's going on. Please don't hurt us. Purge our presence? What do you mean? Memory at capacity. Please defrag to free up memory. Unloading justice protocols. May experience some slight discomfort as we drain the fluids from its foul human husk. It should be honored that its blood shall adorn Agnate armor as we carry out the will of Darius. What the heck? Please forgive our transgression. Is there anyone we can talk to? Now wait, is there anyone else we can talk to? I can explain. We did not mean to come here. Prepare to execute kill command. Death is the only atonement for its crimes. There is no other way. DNA sequencing complete. Cancel kill command. This meat task houses no mutations. How strange. The ascendancy will want to hear of this. Initiate contact with ascendancy. It is a lucky flesh set. To have cheated death so narrowly. Captain Fisher, ready the transport and set course for the bulwark. The bulwark? The ascendancy? No mutations? What do you mean I have no mutations? Memory limit exceeded. To purge memory, please return to charge rejuvenator. This noisy meat has tried my patience enough. Lieutenant Marais, bring the fat one and the agnate dog. Can be used for spares. Huh. The heck is going on? Oh, 
Oh wow, there's a force field around it. I wonder if we're in like a different... I wonder if we're in like a different... version. Like a different... A different time or a different... Like the same place that they were, but it's a different like time. In the future, in the past. Um, or maybe an alternate universe. That's what I mean. Maybe it's like an alternate version of where they lived. That might be it. Okay. New radio frequency. Done. Crash military transport. Connection. Done. Don. Don Leslie, can you hear me? Don. Don. Don, come in. Still, I'm on my way. Okay. Interesting. Engine. Fungi blooms burst from the shattered windows of a ruined building. A ramshackle camp has been built using old army tents and canvas sheets. That thing ain't going no anywhere in a hurry. All right. There we go. I can't believe I survived that crash. Campsite updated. Okay. Is that like a swamp or something? Required. This was not responding. Okay. Yep. Pass, okay. Eroded pillars. The thick tropical foliage has overgrown its surroundings, okay. Ah, you survived an unscathed. What the heck? You are still strong, my child, still strong. Old Dolly? But it was you caused that crash? It was the explosion that caused the crash, and I caused the explosion. So I suppose I did cause the crash. This time. <laughs> the heck? You could have died. I should kill you. I need to find my brother. My brother. I have to find him. He was pulled out. I think I saw a parachute. Ah, your brother. The other, yes. He is certainly alive. He always lives. Always. What the heck? Doesn't. What the heck? Is it not better to die a meaningful death than to live a meaningful life? I'm sorry. I was asleep. <laughs> is this a dream? What the heck? No, not so. This is now. I'm tangled up. Oh, 
weirdo. Tell me where I am. 33.7193 degrees south by 18.4543 degrees east. Milkbush Ocean Wall. The where has stayed, but the when has changed. I knew it. I'm not certain, not certain how many days have passed. I think I may have been asleep for some time. But the record shows the passage of centuries. There is so much data, so much. And we need to get to work. You said that Don is alive. How do I get to him? Please. Such care and compassion. I had forgotten how much love lies within you. You will find your brother. And if he's hurt, we need to hurry. There is a vehicle to the south that is in need of repair. The parts you require are aboard the crashed transport. Once the craft is ready, you will need a new net. The puppet has one. Now I need to go. This feels wrong. Wrong. The strings are still so tangled. Go. Now. What the heck? I'm so confused. That thing is weird. What on earth? I need to go back and get the parts. It's like this is, it's like he knew, like this has happened before, or I don't know. He said, okay, I guess I got to go there first and then come back. I don't know. So we'll attempt. What the heck? Keep moving. Are you kidding me? You won't keep moving. So where am I supposed to go then? Root bridge. What the heck? Wait, 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 wait. I got an idea. Of course it's got a hole. Can't see it, but it does. See wall. What the hell's here? Update. Okay. it for over here That's it for over there
We have push break. Oh, wait, wait, wait. This is the beach. But he said he was at the wall. There he is. Maybe. Missing components. Neural network avionics database. Hello? Is anyone here? Graffiti. What the hell did you do? I, are you blaming me for this? This was certainly none of my doing. We need you to find a way out of here. I didn't cause our crash. Listen here, Toaster. We've got work to do. I know you're probably a bit shaken up, but we need to find a way out of here. I am not shaken up. I am attempting to initiate contact with Control, and until Control is updated with our current SID rep, I am not leaving. Fine. Stay here. Rest in the salt air. Your kind always just gets in the way. Wait. Maybe. Maybe you are right. I have been scanning for open frequencies, and control is nowhere to be found. All right. I will join you. But I will not be treated as a pet, nor as a tool. I will accompany you until I can make contact with control. And when we get back, you will be placed under arrest for trespassing on an active military base. <laughs> if we get back and you still feel that way, I'll go quietly. Let's get off the speech. Don't... Treat me. Threaten me. First things first, eh? Let's get off this beach. Let's go, civilian. I'm on your six. Okay. That's good. We gotta back up. Wall Robo has come to arrest him. What was that? The heck is this? He's doing something. Okay, I guess not. No records of these shipwrecks. Come on, this way. Come on, this way. Now you go this way. You're just going to get stuck. Yep, let's see. Come on, this way. Jeez. Stupid robot.
I gotta go back to the ship and get the parts. What happened here? Nice. I've got a frequency. It's not control, but it is something. This troop transport has its own sentience. It is dying. I do not know what to do for it, what to say to it. Can't you shut it down? Agnates don't have off switches, you fleshy blister. It's broken, split in two. It is slowly fading away. Hello, I'm here. You're not alone. Not alone. Can't it just, I don't know, back itself up? It's gone. It's just gone. I'm sorry. At least it heard some kind words in its final moments. I know this is hard, but I need access to its diagnostics. I suppose it is what must be done. By the way, I'm Prototype Zero Zero Combat Helper. You can call me Pooch. Mark. Mark Pooch. Pooch, huh? Great name. You can call me Pooch, he says. Is that another collectible right there? We need that. What else do we need? Is that it? Okay, that's it. Yeah, we're done here, right? I don't think we can get any other parts. Well, we might be able to get parts from this thing. Are they going to talk to each other? They might. Nope. Nothing. Careful, civilian. Don't fall in. I can't swim. If this fits on that. That's a Buffalo Troop transport. Okay. Mm -mm. Uh -uh. Add a component to Buffalo. <laughs> Neural network. Where do we get that from? Where do we get the neural network from? Hmm. Not quite sure. I guess we'll have to go back to the ship. I don't know. Anything over here? Can we go down here? Oh, we can. Animal oh, remains. Look at the size of that thing. That is a big animal, whatever it is. The big deer looking sort of thing. That is huge. Oh, well, there's got to be something else I can use. Neural network. Hmm. 
if there's anything down here. We were just down here, and not, I didn't see anything else. Maybe at that boat? Not that boat, but the other one? Well, Super. radio signals. Hmm. Nope. There's nothing here. Shoot. What do we do? It's gotta be back at the ship. It's gotta be. I don't see any other half submersion white sand. Neural network. That's what we need. see anything else that we could take from um let's see gotta be from where could it be Shoot, I don't know what to do. Neural network. What is this? Oh, there we go, there we go. What'd you find, what'd you find? Come on, be something good. What is it? What is it? Come on, find something good. Come on, Fido, find something. Shoot, where are we gonna get it from? There we go, talk. I installed the avionics data bus. I just need that neural net. Ah, I see that you have found your companion. It is good, good that she survived as well. Once you have found your brother, what do you plan to do? There has to be a way back. If he's dead, I'll be back for you. We'll find someone to help us. We'll get away from here. We'll find someone to help us get back. Many will help you if you ask for their help. You will cast the stone into the water and create ripples. The ripples will open a maelstrom into which time itself will spill. Yeah, spare. there's a time element the going on. They can pull the Penrose from being held in this place and time. A portal? A way back to 1986. Back to the start of the string, or to its end. Even if the portal between them and now was open this minute, the Penrose would still be bound to this place. The Ascendancy, the Tribulationists, they have it trapped. They worship it, yet they fear that it will leave them. To open the portal, you will need to repair the array that pulled the Penrose into your way. And release the spinning crimson anchors at Babel that hold the Penrose trapped to our ware. Tell me more about these anchors. Once the array is switched on and the portal is open, the anchors must be disrupted. 
I do not know how this can be done, but with the array activated and the well open, the temple will be in chaos. Chaos. What is the array? The three arms of the array are bound together through time. They exist at the start of the string, and now here at its end. So the array existed back in my time? Yes, but over the centuries, the three arms have been torn apart. They require a power source of red mercury. This is interesting. That lets them communicate with the past. And a slingshot to rip open time and space. I knew it was a time Where can thing. I, find all these I knew it. This puppet managed to track the red mercury to an agnet named Grey, who runs an outpost called the Kettle. The other items? You will have to seek those out for yourself. Okay. Now go, my child, go. Overriding safety protocols. Ejecting neural net. So weird. So weird. I'm not sure. I was I was muted for a few minutes. Um so I'm not sure how much neural network controller. Okay, good. So we got the other part. We got this part. I'm glad that I came back here, found it. Okay, good, good, good. All right. So, yeah, this is crazy. I, I knew there was some sort of time element at play. And this crazy skeleton uh, <laughs> robot just explained a little bit of it. So we have to basically override it and figure out how to get back to 1986. Hmm. Sci-fi and time. Okay. I like different. I definitely like different. And this is so different. All right. There we go. Watch it take off on us. Just leaves us there. Is it going to? Where is he going? He's running on his own right now. I'm not controlling him. Okay. Buffalo? I've integrated the Buffalo's voice commands into the radio. We will also be able to use the autopilot thanks to the new avionics bus. I would have figured it out. Don't mess with these things. Thanks, Pooch. Thanks, Pooch. I don't think I could have done that myself. Hey, it pays to be nice, you know? Hey, look at this. This is cool. Oh, this is awesome. What a crazy game. What a crazy game. I did not expect any of this. I mean, I had no idea. All right, there's a little town up there. There's a town here in that crater. All right, there's something here and there. Milk, but that's where we were, okay. Milk bush beach, okay, that's where we found the pooch. Okay, so that's where we were. All right, what's over here? Oh, we got all sorts of stuff going on. What is that? The Warden? Holy cow. This game's pretty cool. All right, let's just pick a location. Um, Let's see. Left on the D-pad. What does it say? Warden, Milk Bruce, Array Site, Agni Outpost, Array Site, Milk Bruce, the Witherberg. I don't really know where we're supposed to be going. What is this place? Ray site. Sure. Looks good. So far, I, I kind of dig it. 
I'm, I'm into the story. It's super strange. Rusted Agnate. The Agnate shell corrodes in the elements. There's a Twisted Agnate's frame in the wild grass. The thick concrete slabs are crooked and cracked. Every surface of the copter is crushed with red erosion. It looks like this agnate has been strung up in a symbiotic execution above the metal wreckage flickering a hazy hologram of what the agnate used to be okay we got a collectible the agnate is strung up okay on a cross-shaped metal frame vivid low veiled blossoms have pushed their way through cracks in the concrete agnate compounds are strewn through the bushes These things can't really die, can they? So why execute them? Well, there's a reason. There's our ship. Okay. A few sections of the fortified wall still stand tall. Some sort of a stag or deer flag hanging from it. Alright, let's see. There was something in the middle. There we go. This spire-like structure looks ancient. I think I could connect to it. Getting some strange signals from this thing. Red mercury tether, tear slingshot. Array components are missing. Lead parts into the receiving tray. Load. I'm sorry. Load parts into the receiving tray. Okay. So we gotta find all three parts somewhere. So how do I get the parts from this thing? Looks like I need parts from these certain things. Can I go over here? Nope. It's blocked off. Unless I can go around over here. This looks ancient. Will it let me? Nope. Blocks me off. Shoot. Okay, so now what? Get a little WD-40 over here. Yeah, okay, so I guess that's it for here. Uh, we'll return when we have those parts, I guess. How do we get out of here? Where the heck do we leave? Where is he? What's he doing? It's like sniffing around like a normal dog would.
Oh, I heard chickens. Definitely just heard chickens. So it's an outpost, right? So there's probably people here or other machines or some sort of diagram here. Junk. Yo, Bridgen, what go on? It's oh, a man. nice machine. Buffalo troop transport, eh? With all four engines working. He's a Jamaican. But, yeah, yeah. Buffalo transport. I can see you replace the old busting diesel engines. Smart. Where am I? Uh, it's beautiful here. Where am I? Can you tell me where I am? You're in Weatherberg, friend. Furthest place away from anywhere you could find. So how you find your way to this little slice of heaven? With a buffalo, you must see I come from the warden. I'm looking for a crash satellite, a warden. If I could get away, I would. I'm looking for a crash I'm satellite. I'm looking for a place where a satellite crashed. Any ideas? And where you want to know about that for? I'm looking for my brother. He's lost, but I managed to contact him, and he described a buried satellite before his radio died. Just happens I know where that is. But if you're going that way, my friend... I'll be needing something. You want to ride? There's a crash space satellite close to the ward. I need something from there. Maybe you could refresh my memory. Who or what is a warden? <laughs> well, I'm always happy to make a new friend, even when them look slow. Warden. Big spinning gateway. Out past the city ruins. Let's you travel far to the other place safely through the ether. The ether? My friend. You're more than a little slow today. Ether, radiation. Oh, you survived so long not knowing how to avoid the rainbow gas. You need the warden access device in order to get through. I can install a spear for you. For your price. And I just, and if I just take it from you, sorry, I don't have the money. Only thing I have is the dog. Hmm. Ah, uh, sorry, I don't have money, but uh, maybe we could work something out. What about the dog? Spear Agnite parts pretty rear own here. No way. No, no way. I would never trade her. Easy, dear friend. Jerry could never take a man's dog. But, eh, there's something I need more than Agnite spears. At the buried satellite close to the warden, I want the Alexis computer core. I even added to your map there. Bring me the core, and I'll upgrade your buffalo real nice with a one access device. See you soon, friend. Okay, that, that's trade off. Fair trade off, I guess. Guard. What the heck? Yeah, there's that deer-looking thing, Abby. This must be a bar or something. Yeah, okay. All right, so I think this is actually a good spot to uh, save. And we'll wrap up this uh, first look episode. I'm digging it so far. I really, I think this is... Uh, a super interesting story. Alright, so that's where I'm going to end my first look at Beautiful Desolation here on PlayStation. I do appreciate you watching on Nalio Gaming. If you haven't already done so, please click that like button. Let me know in the comment section what you think. Share with your friends. Follow me on Twitter at RiseUp44 and at Nalio Gaming. And please consider subscribing to me here on Nalio Gaming. So, just to let you know, if I didn't already mention it earlier, I was provided with a game key thanks to Matt over at Evolve PR. So, shout out to everyone at Evolve. On behalf of Untold Tales, um, the publisher and the developer, and just huge shout out and thanks to everyone involved. It's it's definitely got a cool story going for it. It's like, it's, it's a sci-fi, future. it's not futuristic. Well, I guess for the character, it's futuristic because... You know he's back in the 80s in South Africa and then they go to this 
this alien uh, spacecraft that kind of changed everything for them. And he wants answers because his wife died. And, you know, they got all these advances for technology. But he was really stuck wondering what the heck happened to his wife. And he wanted answers. So he got his brother to take him. And, uh, well, you know. We're, we're seeing what happened. They they got up there on the alien ship and it like teleported them to a different space and time. And now they're they're trying to find his brother who got hurt and and they're gonna have to try to make their way back. So we're meeting all these robots and these alien robots and stuff. And uh, we'll get to the bottom of it as the story progresses. But I'm digging it. It gets a thumbs up from me. You know, pick it up on your platform of choice. Of course, like I said, I'm playing on PlayStation Five. And uh, yeah, so far so good. Uh, I'm going to wrap it up there. Again, thanks to everyone involved uh, with this game, and we'll, uh, we'll leave it off there. I appreciate you. I appreciate you all watching, and we'll see you next time.